tell me it's not an illusion. Oh, tell me it's not an illusion. I see a hawk. Probably a red-shouldered hawk. Sorry about the noise. That's actually a lawnmower that I'm hearing. Um, yeah, I'll have to get closer to... Well, maybe. We'll see. This is part of the problem. Getting close. So I'm going to just sit down here and try to film it from a distance, okay? This is what professionals do, okay? Alright, so as soon as I get my camera out, I'll start again. So it just, like, uh, swooped down on something, maybe. Yeah, but there it is again. Yep, there it is. Yeah, it just flew off on me. I'm just not sure. Is that a red-shouldered hawk? Is it? Is it? Yeah, it's got to be. See, so yeah, very nice. I'm all out of digital zoom here. Let me see if I can get closer to it again. Right, so this is me trying to walk closer to it now. Maybe there's a chance it'll allow me to get closer. Or maybe not. Oh, I'm starting to approach some tree branches here. red-shouldered hawk. I love this guy. I'm gonna just try. I'm just gonna try to lay down and film it. Okay? I'm gonna stop the recording. Oh man. There it goes. Aww. So flew down over there. Well, at least I have my tripod this time. So I guess he was trying to get something. Maybe there's a possibility he just wants to watch him, watch him hunt. I don't know. Thank you for letting me watch you hunt. I appreciate that. That's what I like to see. Hunting. Hunting is fun. Hunting is a lot of fun. I love watching you hunt. Yes. That's... Oh yeah. Oh yeah. He's... He's looking directly at me. I love this. Beautiful talons. There it is, red-shouldered hawk, right there. Kinda. There we go, it's better. believe I'm filming a hawk this close. This is the closest in a long time I filmed a hawk. Oh, you are so gorgeous. You really are. I just love watching you. <sighs> Dare me to get closer? Nah, I think here is good. Try this.
So I'd say I'm about 80 feet away from this red shoulder talk right here. So yeah, there he is. Right on top of that pole. Love it. Oh, he's looking at me. Oh, he's looking at me. me to get closer. <sighs> then if it flies off, that's the end of the footage. What should I do? Oh. oh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, all the way down there. And you can't see him very well because... Oh, there he is. I don't know if he caught anything. Oh, where is he going now? Oh, that's the hardest thing about filming this talk. And he flew all the way, all the way up there. Yeah, I can't control where this hawk lands. All I know is that he just lands where he wants to land, you know? But still very impressive. Although lighting isn't quite as great right here. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so this is always difficult when the subject moves. Yes, yeah, so this is all the way on optical zoom. Okay, I'm not on digital zoom mode yet. But that's all right. Yeah, I do want to try to get closer to this hawk if I'm able to. Um, I don't really like the way that hawk just flew off like that, even though... I mean, he might come back, who knows. But I am interested in getting close to him. I'm sure he knows that by now. I mean, I'm not trying to get too close, I'm just... trying to get a better view of him. Let's try it again, okay? Yeah, the lighting's like horrible right here. 
opinions everyone should I try to get closer maybe maybe not yeah the lighting is pretty bad right here so I'd rather just try to get closer take a chance you know what choice do I have? But maybe I, if I go this way, maybe if I go this direction, maybe, maybe he won't fly off. I mean, the biggest problem is that, see where he is? See where the sun is? Yeah. Oh, oh crap. See, that's, this is why you can't like look into a camera and walk at the same time. Might trip over something. Uh. Accidentally hit the stop button. That's all right. We're gonna film this off whether he likes it or not. Gotta, I gotta adjust this thing. Focus is bad right here. Dang it. There we go. Okay, so this is actually all the way on. This is all the way on optical zoom, not digital zoom. So you can see this hawk quite perfectly right here. Very beautiful. Beautiful hawk. He's so beautiful. Yep. Full optical zoom, baby. Full clarity. Yeah, the picture's not cropped. You're getting the full pixels right here. Is coming. But the hawk knows that they're going that way. Yeah, the bikers are going the other direction. I'm thinking this hawk is definitely in hunting mode. Yeah, this hawk's definitely hunting right now. And the reason why I say that is because it's just 
doesn't really seem to be doing anything else except looking around. He's not preening up his feathers or anything like that. But it could be because I'm here. Maybe this hawk is sort of afraid of me. So I always like to wait until they get comfortable. I just don't know what this hawk's going to do if I try to get closer. So I'm actually in a gazebo right now. So I'm, so I'm like, uh, you know, I'm underneath something. So I'm at a location where I can film this hawk without it being afraid of me. And I'm not really sure what else to say, really. Clean a little bit. What should I do? I mean, I I really want to get closer. I really do. Well, if I say I do, and I do, then that's the flying off. Then I have no footage. What should I do? Hmm. Biker's coming towards the hawk. Oh, there it goes. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. 
Let's see what happens now. Oh, that hawk. That hawk is upset. It flew very far away. It is out of my sight. Oh, that's the end of the recording. Huh. Well, yeah, biker went past it and it scared it off. So, at least I know this hawk is not very tolerant of people. I, I, I am in Jacksonville, but it's a little bit off city, you know, I mean, it's, I'm at m something Memorial Park, I just can't remember exactly, like, what location this is, but once I figure out, I'll put it in the video description, all right, so yeah, that hawk's gone, it's not even at this park anymore, yeah, that, that person was biking pretty quick. Yeah, let's, let's see if I can try to see if I can find again. And if I do, I'll film it. And if I don't, well, I guess I'll see you next time. Take care, everybody. Oh, I found you again. Isn't that something? Yeah, I went into this neighborhood development, and there he is. So now there's nothing stopping me now. It's about as close as I was before. I like this even better. Yeah. There he is, red shouldered hawk. I'm still at it, baby. Question is, how long will he stay there? Here comes a car. Don't be honking, don't be honking. Don't honk your horn at me. Keep driving. Oh, he's being bothered by another bird, unfortunately. Such is the life of a raptor. Yes. Yeah, you know, I was just about to go to another park, and then I figured, hmm, well, this road keeps going. The road where the park is, so maybe I'll give it a try. And he's going to use the bathroom. Yep. And he's going to take off. Watch. Just you wait and see. And there's Mockingbird again. You saw it, right? Yeah, just tried to attack that hawk. So, yeah, and there are some cars driving by on this road, so I apologize for the uh, traffic noise, if there is any. So, we'll just um, let these cars pass us here, all right? Okay, so there's that one, okay. So it doesn't look like it's flying off, even though I thought it was. Yeah, he's still he's still right there right now. Yeah, I really thought he was gonna fly off, and then watch what happens when I zoom in. He's gonna fly off. So that's with digital zoom, so you can see the red shoulder hawk all the way where his head is. All right. Oh, and there we go. Yeah, see, that's what happens. So he flew over past that bush and then somewhere over there. But now 
That's going to be like impossible to find him now. Uh, well, I know he flew that way towards the park. So maybe there's a possibility that maybe he came back to the park. Or maybe not. But I did hear some um, sounds. There's some sounds coming from over there. Maybe dogs. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure. But I, uh, I'll try to see if I can find this hog again. Give it another try.